So in the last few WordPress videos, I showed you how to download WordPress and get your theme set up and ready for development. And in this one, I'm going to show you how to convert HTML and CSS into uh, an actual WordPress theme using the WordPress uh, functions. Now, um, I'm not going to actually type out all the HTML and CSS for you. I don't want to waste too much time. So I made it available for download. And you can go to easydevtoots.com and just click right here. And uh, you can download all the theme files and everything will be set up. Um, if you don't want to do that, I created a code pen. And you can come here and you can just uh, copy and paste all the HTML and CSS and drop them right into your theme files. Um, and I'll do that in a minute and show you how. But here's our, here's our layout, quick preview. Um, first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to copy all of this HTML and I'm going to go back to my editor and you see I cleared out my index.php and I'm just going to paste everything in there and I'll save that and then i uh, switch back to my browser and I'll go to the CSS section and I'll copy and paste all of that as well um, okay. So let me see, I'll save this and I'll save this one. Switch back to my browser and my theme was blank before. And when I refresh it, it's set up. And it has all the elements uh, for my whole page template that I want. Again, if you watched uh, my last few videos, you should be able to just copy and paste everything. And um, you know, it should look exactly like this. If it doesn't, just go ahead and like I said, go to my website and download it and um, just drop it into your theme directory. Um, while you're here, you could also like and follow if you'd like. Now, if you're, um, if you're new to the videos that I've been posting, then uh, you should know that we're using Bootstrap 2.3. It's the latest version uh, at this moment. And then it's got a couple of new features in it. It's got this nav bar that has all of your uh, menu items kind of centered and uh, evenly laid out. However, I don't I'm not sure if this works in Firefox or not because uh, I checked it out a minute ago and it didn't look right. But anyway, I'm using Chrome. Um, 2.3 has cursor indicators. I don't I don't know if they're available in 2.2.2, but I never noticed them. Anyway, they're there now. And also, um, sticky footer support was placed in the documentation. And I've got all that set up already, so you don't have to worry about uh, learning how to use it. If you decide to download it from my website, um, you'll get the latest version of Bootstrap 